It's still Friday. It's still night. It's still New York. And it's still improv. So, And you're still with us. Thank you for being here. And what we're going to do next is a improv, a scene with Stephanie and Bridget. So let's dive right in. Stephanie, why don't you get a suggestion? Um, I would like a location, please. A bowling alley. Thank you. Now, remember, you can pick anywhere within that bowling alley. You can work there. You can be visiting anywhere you like in the bowling alley. And uh, Bridget, uh, what would you like to get? I would like a an emotion. Paranoia. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. All right, then. Um, if you are not Stephanie or Bridget, please mute your microphones at this time, myself included, and you please take your time and have fun. Edwina. I really can't stand when they don't put the sides up for the kids on these railings here. It's just gutter ball after gutter ball after gutter ball. I mean, little Timmy's crying. I know. I really think, I really think the manager has it in for us. Yeah, I do. I, I think, I think that's the manager is Dean Appleby, who I went to high school with. And I think he, we never got along in high school. And I am sure that he really wants us to not leave and not come back. Whoa. Okay. That's Dean. That's Dean. <laughs> I mean, uh, okay. I mean, fine. You and Dean get along. Dean and you get along. That's fine. I'll straighten this out. I will straighten this out. I'm going to go right up to Dean and let him know we need guardrails right now. Guardrails up all the kids and more pizza. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Oh, I mean... You can you can talk to Dean. You can say whatever you like, but but just because you get guardrails up and everything, the pizza. I don't want to get the pizza here. You know what they put in the pizza? They put that like hormone infused like milk, like the the mozzarella that comes from the cows that they feed hormones, and then you get like you know where boys grow breasts and stuff like that. Like I do not want to get the pizza here. Okay. I don't know about that last part, but the first part, that's what makes it taste good. That's why we come. So the kids eat the pizza and we go to the bar. It's open. We go to the bar. Kids eat pizza, guardrails up. We're only using the light ball so nobody gets hurt. I, I, I mean, you, you have a lot of faith in this place. You have a lot of faith that you don't want to say anything, Dean. I do not share your faith that he's not like giving, using shoddy balls here that are going to hurt the kids' feet. Well, I never thought of it that way. I mean, you think about it. If, if, if Allison is swinging back and those balls aren't fitting right. And you know that they're like, and if they're weighted wrong and she swings her arm back, she can go whoosh and the ball goes flying and hits Timmy in the face. And what good is the guardrail at that point? I ask you, no good at all because it doesn't matter because we're going to the emergency room. It's not going to work because the ball's going the other way. That's right. Oh, no, it's no, it's if it, if it slides off her hand. No, yeah, well, maybe. <laughs> wait, I, okay, wait a minute. It happened. Wait, what? It could happen. The ball slips and goes the wrong way. Right, right, exactly, exactly. Exactly what I'm saying. And I tell you, Dean, I think Dean puts like 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 
uh, what do you call it? Uh, Vaseline. Vaseline. I think he sticks it down into the finger holes of the ball so that they'll slide off because I'm sure he wants to hurt people. Oh my goodness. Maybe that's what those tattoos mean. He's got them all over his body. Yeah. Yeah. He's, he's definitely just, he's definitely not the cool guy you thought he was. But the tattoos are on the muscles. <laughs> They're on the muscles, so like. <laughs> and see, that's what's wrong with America, folks. We have Vaseline in our ball holes. Right there. And we, we oh. like to get away with it because of their muscles. All right. Fabulous scene. Thank you, Stephanie. And thank you, Bridget. And thank you for watching. We're going to be back with more improv for you in just a moment.